Please don't let me down, let me down, let me down. Hey, what's up, everybody? I'm just here, just home chilling, just messing around on GarageBand. <laughs> and I'm, um, so I just thought that I would just like, um, kind of show you like what I'm doing and how I'm doing it. So this is GarageBand and this is, um, in the drum sequence section. So I'm going to go back for you guys. So you see here where you have the drums. So this right here is where I went into. And as you can see, you have keys, you know, you have sound library, uh, you have the drummers, automatic, and you have all the different string instruments. And you can record by hooking in a microphone and then back to the drums. So this is what I chose. So I'm just thinking of, you know, new ideas and new music and stuff like that that I can come up with. And basically all you do is you select the sound and it'll go through and it'll play the sound for you, as you see. And you can select another sound. Let's put a clap in there. Let's move the clap over. So you see, it just kind of starts sequencing it for you. Let's see what else can we add. Also, you can go into the mode and you can choose. I'm on 808. You can choose 909. Hear the difference? Ah. So let's keep it there. Ah. Go, go, go. <laughs> let's add a snare. Let's see. Let's see. It's, it's so effortless and you can still record with it. Like while you're doing this, you can still add to it. You can take away from it. So if you touch it again, now that sound is gone. You put it back. Very, very simple. And if you scroll up here, you discover more sounds. So there's ride, clap to, pedal, you know, you can see them crash tone. So this is what you do. It's like, you can add this sound. Let's say, let's add another kick sound. Now let's add it in. Let's put it over here. Ah. Yep. Yep. So this is, that's how that works. You can touch them in a row. You can deselect them, take them all back off. Pretty cool. Now, here's the metronome. So that'll keep the time for you. And wait, let me see. Let's see. So I have mine on, what am I going to select? I have mine on wood clock. Yeah, I have mine on wood clock, so I'm gonna keep it there. And you don't have to have it so loud, you know, where it's disturbing while you're creating. All right, so then you just click off of that. And it also has tracks that is created for you. So if you touch this middle button right here, it creates the track for you. And if you touch that button, it shows you all the different tracks that you can choose. Like, here's one. Modern, analog. Let's see. Let's go to Slow Jam. Cool, right? So what you can do is, while you're doing this, you let this play this for you. And... Let's put the metronome on. So now the metronome is on. And the metronome is 
making sure that our beat is in time. Right? So we're going to stick with this one. This is already made for you. I showed you how to make your own and you can also choose how to make one for you. So if you're bored in your home and you have a garage band and you just kind of want to mess around and make a beat or make a little song, this is a good way to do it. All right, so now that's going for us. So I'm going to record this. So let's stop it. I'm going to take it to the beginning. And I'm going to press record on this. I know that the ceiling light, my recess lights are like messing around with this. It's like right there. Um, so I hope it's not too disturbing for you guys. Um, let me see if I set this up. Maybe I can get that out a little bit more. I just have this on my pillow. Yeah, that's a little better, actually. Okay, so. So we're going to record this, so let's record it. And you see the red line going across? That means it's recording. I'm really feeling this beat, y'all. Oh. I'm really liking this. Okay, so now we've recorded it. Let's play it back. Oh. And there it is. And that is made for you. Okay, so now let's go into here. So now you see this is the page where the track is kept. So this is the track that we just did with the automatic drums. Okay, so now you're going to go down here. We're going to select and let's add some, let's add some keys. So we're going to select here and Let's see, so here you can play your own. Um, but let's see, let's get some chords going. So this is where the chords are. You can see up here where you can choose what you actually want. And then down here, you can play it. All right, so now we're gonna play the, play the track. Let's see what chords we can put with this. Alright, so we don't want that sound. So let's change our sound over here. And we're going to choose another sound. So let's just see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I'm sorry, you guys. It's a little blurry. I know. It's like, I don't know why it's doing that. So we're going to go to keys. And let's select, uh, let's see, chill keys. Let's see, theta keys. All right, so let's go to chill keys. Because right now, I'm not feeling the other ones. So let's go to chill keys. And click done. So now let's play the track. So it plays all the chords for you, right? And all you have to do after that is just record the chords and keys together. So let's, let's, let me show you how I did that. I came up with so now let's put it all together so that's what I came up with so I just wanted to show you guys, like, that's how easy it is. Uh, honestly, if you're into music and you're into singing or, you know, you just kind of want to create, you don't have money for a studio and, you know, an engineer and a producer, you kind of can produce your own stuff right here on GarageBand. And now is a good time to fall in love with your passion. It's a great time to discover 
new things about yourself regardless of what it is mine just one of my things just happened to be music pray for those on the front line pray for those that have lost loved ones in this fight in this battle against this pandemic but we'll make it out you guys so let's all do our part stay inside work on your passion and i'm inside and i'm going to work on mine my garage fan so i hope to see you guys in the next video bye Please don't let me down, let me down, let me down. Oh.